Hello everybody, as you can see, look in the big ice cream here, and today we are playing the new Fiesta Fathom Woodbury Getaway. As you can see, I have now a webcam, because I found it in my house. Well, my other house. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I found it. So, now you can see my face. Ugly face, ugly face. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's play. <coughs> Woodbury Getaway. New game, I said right down to the low sentence, so you'll actually have good <laughs> gameplay footage instead of like type gameplay footage. So, yeah, it says at the top here, oh, let's jump right down to 38 frames per second. Well, let's you won't be getting good frame rate, sorry to tell you, for God's sake. No, oh, let's play. Needed coffee to get done with the day. Ooh, ooh. No, oops. at that point I couldn't continue my work without a cup of coffee. My God, absolute coffee addict. So as you can see, all the settings are really bad, but I don't want to have one gigabyte like frame, whatever, you know what I mean? I don't want one frame per second. No. What do you want, SYD? I'm trying to get this work done. I was just checking if you need anything. Can't these clients ever make up their minds? I know. What keeps you here just... <laughs> What keeps you here so late again? Just wrapping up. You yeah, bar. Uh, where do we go? Oh, wait. Literally passed it. No. Brain dead. I needed to prepare a cup of coffee. Uh, what do I do? It's like milk or something. You don't need milk. I don't know why. Oh, wait. Let's get milk right there, man. Brain dead. What? Oh, what? Oh, water. Oh, my God, I'm thick. Right. Turn on. What? Apologies, I have not played this game in like ages, so I forgot what to do. Do I think I have a cup and fill up? Oh. No, what do I do? I actually blind it. No, I've learned how to do it now. Never ever hide me at workplace, my gum, dumb. I can't even handle a cup of coffee. I need to put on it. Oh my god, man. You are an absolute whinge. Oh my god. Man. I need to use the restroom. Get out of my way. Hello? Okay. What is that? Oh my! Who was this man? Let's throw them. I'm so sorry, ma'am. I didn't know you were in here. What, and you couldn't hear me having the most massive ween known to man? 
It's okay. I like to clean late because it's pretty quiet at this hour. You working late again, huh? Yeah, well... You young folks sure do put in the hours. Make sure to take care of yourself. You too. Yeah, have fun. Have fun clean this, mate. Yeah, you need to stop that now. Run, run. Oh my god, that scared the crap out of us. I thought we were about to get backhanded or something, man. <laughs> my god, that was jump scare. Sydney Harper, that's a name. Hello? Hey, Harp, it's Mike. Hey, Mike. I've been trying to call yourself for the last two hours. It just keeps going to voicemail. Is everything all right? Yeah, my phone's been acting up lately. Oh, snap. I was starting to think maybe you were ignoring me. <laughs> uh. No, you even could have on the client earlier. I'm just kidding. <laughs> um... Uh, anyway, uh, what are you still doing at work? It's getting Get kind of this late. man arrested immediately. Work has been overwhelming lately. Damn, Art, that sounds rough. Good thing I called to cheer you up. Um, about our trip, did you get a chance to book the rental house? Just really wanted to see you. And Nora. I was going to do no worries, Harper. I don't want to stress you out. As long as you book it tonight, I think it'll be fine. Hey, I was thinking, since we both live in the city, maybe I could pick you up and ride this together. This is the killer nice idea. Catch up. You know, save on gas and relive the good old days. Just a little bit of Mike and Sydney time before Nora gets there. Sounds good. Great. Uh, I guess I'll let you get back to work then. Yeah, leave me. Oh, uh, wait, one more thing. When you book the rental, please make sure to keep it under a hundred dollars a night. No. Nora and I were talking and she's been on a pretty tight budget. Things haven't been going very well for her. True. Oh, you know, just like the old college days. You always had a knack for finding the best spots. I should really make the book a no. Right, right, of course. Sorry for yapping. I'm just excited, I guess. Alright, talk to you later, Harp. Bye. My common. No, no. Tape invader. What's this? Game. Yes. Go, go, go. This is pretty cool, actually. I am about to die now. Yeah. 
looks like I didn't. I'm not allowed to type in YouTube. Where are you going? Post it coming. I'm apparently going to Woodbury. Hmm. Hmm. Oh my god, this is so boring. But this is really what being an adult is like because my god's born. Looking has been confirmed. Hey, I'm assuring you get hundreds if not thousands of stories said daily. So I'll give you a basic rundown of something that happened to me. I'm sorry if some of it is written weird, but I was rushed. Okay. When I was in my early 20s, I worked at a big consultant firm in my city. Life at the firm was a great constant juggle of mist of deadlines, clients, meetings, and trying to prove my worth, which didn't leave much room for leisure, let alone a social life. The job was paid well, but the job paid well, sure, but at the end of the in my middle of peace. I'm terrible at speaking. I'm Cindy Harper, and this, is, this story takes place during one of those days. One of my first friends, Mike, Suggested that we take a weekend to get away to World Fever Vermont, which sounded like a perfect break for my single of work. <laughs> and my other friend Noah was quick to jump, was quick to jump on board as well. The plan was simple we rent a small cabin, close our ship daily on Friday, leave, and be back on Monday. Mike came to pick me up. Okay, boy. <coughs> oh, my foot throws head now. What the actual, oh my god. Mm. Oh my god, it's got the PSP. Yeah. Afternoon, a quite chilly day. Hey, I've seen you around, but I haven't had a chance to introduce myself. I'm Gail. I'm Sydney. Nice to meet you. <laughs> if you talk like that, you actually need to go get your voice checked. You're on the 10th floor, right? I'm on the 8th. That's right. I thought so. I've been getting, I've been, I've seen you a few times getting off the tenth floor when I'm all home late from work. <clears throat> what do you do for work? Me? I'm a software engineer. What about you? I work at a council and firm downtown. Oh, I see. Anyways, I hope you have a great rest of your day. I need some to get some groceries before the store starts. You too. I lost that forever there. Hello. No. Not the actual. No, I'm fine. Harp. <laughs> hmm. What type of voice can I give? No. That's still how you hook people. Why don't you hook me like you missed me? Pardon? You look good. So do you, Mike. You can just throw your stuff in the back and we'll get on our way. I don't know what. I've changed like voices like 55 times there. I don't know what the hell. Alright then, hope. Are you ready to the road? No, I'm not. <laughs> Sorry. Starting to snow. Nope. 
This was actually a gift from my co-worker, Ricky. Said he owned it at a garage sale and it reminded him of me somehow. I can see a little bit of resemblance. It's the cowboy spirit, I guess. There's no cowboy spirit in you, mate. Well, not in the actual. Okay, whatever. Bor uh, can I like jump up the car and then just walk there and what? Because this guy's probably gonna crash his car like. Ooh. Harp, isn't it weird? We used to dream about cat escaping at our cards and now we're here. <coughs> Sorry. Trying to escape from the life we want to live. We couldn't wait to get out of the real world. Get out of the real world. No. Rick Wilson. Maybe maybe we didn't know how much we, we would would <laughs> look sometimes. What in the actual? Did you see that? Did you see that school bus? See what? That was a school bus. Oh, no, not the other face. Maybe it's a project. You know, someone's idea. <laughs> yeah, actually, stop. You know, someone's idea of turning it into a tiny home or on wheels or something. I've read people do that on the internet. Yeah, that's Pretty bad voice, and that's weird. <laughs> Let's get the crap off us. Oh, Snow! That was close! You know, out around the internet, that in Native American lore, seeing a deer cross your path is like getting a message from the other universe. Ears are all wrong in a half, I can already tell. God. Oh, boys, it no. Should be around an hour and a half from here, you know. Driving through the snow kind of feels like we're traveling through the skeleton intergalactic space. What do you mean? Look at the way the snowflakes swirl around the headlights. It's like stars and galaxies rushing past us. No, it isn't, mate. It's kind of beautiful. No. <laughs> Let's just go something else different, okay? <laughs> I don't know what to do. You are. Check that out. Moe's Pizza. <gasps> like Moe from The Simpsons. You know, Harp, I gotta tell you, these new GPS systems are something else. This pizza is exactly where it appeared on my GPS. It's like living in the future. I'm so hungry, I think I could eat a whole pizza myself. Me too. Alright then, Harp. <laughs> Operation Pit Pizza Pit Stop is a go. Prepare to land. Grinch Lord. Short of this guy. Can it go on? Come on in, Harp. Thank you. How's your day going? Who are you? I'm Sydney. Look, Sydney, we're here just to enjoy our pit and peace. Thanks for understanding. No worries. Pizza, Mike. How's the pizza? Well, my 
You simply can't go wrong with the pepperoni and moles. Every bite reminds you of a story. So what brings you to moles? Just bustin' through. We're headed to a cabin in Woodbury. Woodbury, you say? Beautiful place. Used to camp here quite often when I was a younger man. There's something about being out here in the wilderness. Something sort of that reminds you of my memories. <laughs> Stay with you until I am alone. Anyways, I'm rambling. Young lady, you made a wonderful choice for coming up here, Mose. You come here, Odin. Oh, my dear. I've been coming to Mose since 1885. How old is this guy? Like 60. This place is full of memories for me. Yeah, I don't know. What the heck is this guy? He doesn't have eyes. Evening, folks. Looks like the cold Scott, everyone. Craving pizza tonight. You fine folks, sure. You fine folks know what you want to eat. We'll get three slices each. I'll go with the pepperoni, cheese, and veggie. And for you, miss? Most special. Cheese. Uh, margarita. Any drinks for you folks? That's a cover of pizza. It's the pizza today, thanks. Alright then, six hot slices coming right up. It'll be twenty two fifty. Barn. Your order number's twenty seven. Grab a seat, just grab a seat and we'll call you up when your pizza is ready. Okay. How's your day going? It's going much better now that this pizza, thanks. Now after this pizza, thanks for you, for asking. Now how are you? Great. It's our first time in this area. In the area. Are you from around here? I am. <laughs> oh no, we're on our way to conference in the next town over. <laughs> Not too much farther to go. We just stopped, we just stopped to eat whatever, whatever, the place looks interesting. <laughs> this place sure is a cozy vibe? Best is there's no trip so far. How about you? Local are just passing through. Just passing through? Interesting. Um, I better get back to eating this pizza. Pizza rear, man. <laughs> you have a... Save trip and be cat. Be cat in the snow. And be careful in the snow. Mm. You too. No. Told you all the NPCs in the pizza room. What well, the actual heck's going on over there? It smells so good here. What on earth is going on behind there? guys are going to hate me. I swear, I'll get on the road as soon as I can. But something last minute popped up. I'm not going to bore you with all of the details. The long and short of it is, one of my clients needs a last minute change. Their payments are about the only thing keeping the lights on. I okay. hate to leave so late, but I've got to keep them happy. I'll have this logo done before you know it, and be on my way. Sure. Me. Yeah. I have no idea what these people are doing. Just walking into each other. Absolute freaks. Did you listen to Nora's voice message in the group? Yeah, I just saw. Looks like she'll be late. That's a bummer! Guess we'll have to start the phone without her. What can we do? Don't act like you don't know what I'm talking about. P. 
people like him is what's wrong with the world. Oh, number 27, you folks over here. Okay. Okay, I told him it's a shorty pants over here. Shorty. Hello. <clears throat> Not apparently. Don't like you. Alright, you folks all set. Thank you. What? Mm. Why is he eating them? Oh, darn it. <laughs> Let's beat your slaves. Can't believe Nora is miss missing out on this bomb pizza. Hey, Nora. Not how you eat it. Sorry, by the way. Which one's the most special? That's the most special. <sighs> oh, I absolutely hate that sound. Hey, Dad, my friends. Hello there. I saw that you're pulling about driving. What? That nice watch. Okay. That's right. Not to be a brother or anything, but I was heading down to the road, down the road myself. Seems like we might have been going the same direction. You will not mind if I hitch a ride with you? Where are you headed? Just a heading, just a heading where the road takes me. A bit of an adventure, just I can let you see me coming. Okay. So what do you see? Care to give this free spirit a ride down this snow road? Hey. With us. Hold on a second. Don't you think you should discuss this? You know what we're doing? I'm not sure if we have an extra space to fight another passenger. Oh, yeah, he's right. Yeah, he's right. He's right. Surely you can find just a little bit of room for me. I can ride in the middle. Heck, I can I'll ride in the bed. That's my, my first car, I'm sorry. You got to be pooping me, lady. No space. I, I know there's a metal seat. You scared of me or something? You ain't kind, are you? Unkind people meet the meet unkindness in themselves. What? You best be careful out there. Is that a threat? Are you threatening us? No, no, no. You got me all run. Sorry, I'm just cold and tired. Is all. Yeah. Thanks. Absolute weirdo. Just like this girl woman thing here. Yeah. Are you serious? How are you gonna let a stranger ride with us in the middle of nowhere? I was just trying to help. Yeah, well, seems. So, well, sometimes helping can put you in a bad situation. Alright, Dad! <laughs> oh, God, this man is shiver. It's horrible, isn't it? Of the snow. Are we close? Let's see. If my GPS is right at Chibi here, it should be another about another hour. Give me the keys. Harp, the weather is awful. Why don't you drive Bart both the way the time? Right, let me just ask for the keys. Right? I'm going to drive so you can take a break. I'm afraid of what kind of break you're going to give me, Harp. You'll be afraid if you don't give me the keys. Fine, but there's one condition. What is it? We get, I'll get the first choice of bedrooms when, or if we get there. Whatever. Go. Go, go, go. Oh, 
Hello. I think it crashed. I think it's crashed. Oh my god. I think it's crashed. Oh okay. no. Thank god. Let's get the crap off. This is your host on WKWB. Your hometown station, bringing you the best tunes to warm your hearts on this chilly night. As we embrace the first snowfall of the oh season, my God. there's nothing like a perfect song to set the mood. So here's a track that'll make you feel right at home. Coming up next, Be Sincere by Ed and Lotus. Wow. Oh. Stay tuned. I told you, driving in the snow is no joke. Oh, I'm sorry. I should just let my drive. I just bump into it now. This is why you never let me drive everyone. Never ever let me drive a car. Are, are you okay? Do you, want to take, do you want me to take over? Yeah, please do. Can I please just take over? You can do it. I think. I think the address was two four one. Where we drive? Get in the. Let's go. For God's sake. On Earth, everything is popping so slowly. <laughs> Where the hell did that come from? Did he run some kids over there. Two years later. Still So scary trying to drive this. Oh, whatever. Thank God. Oops. No, I forgot to say what. That's one way to take the scenic route, and this should be it. I thought you were gonna keep driving there. Is the front fine? It doesn't look like you to make out. Hmm. Oh god. Uh, okay then. No. Let's go in. I really need you to. Let's just go hurry up, Barb. Jim. Thank you. 
I got my seizures. That was a great place. I knew I could. I knew we could count you. It's not so nice, new. Right, but I really need to hit that. What? Take your time, mate. Well, I'm gone. Can you put away these put these groceries away? Should be enough space in the fridge. Sure. About that heart. You're okay. Long drive, no, that pizza really didn't number me. No worries. Anyways, this place looks crazy nice. Got that rustic charm you don't just you don't see anymore. Yeah, it's cute. For sure. What the hell is it? You can go out here, I'll start unpacking our bags. Thanks. Why does he keep teleporting to you, man? You feeling better after the draft? Which way now? So, would you check out the place? Sounds good to me. After you. Okay. This man. Oh, hey, you're here. You scared us. Oopsie daisy, I didn't mean to. <laughs> Welcome to my home sweet home. Now, what a lovely couple. No, 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 we're not a couple. You're not to sell the heart. heart. I was just asking a question. You didn't ask a question, Sydney. You made a statement, you never mind. Oopsie daisy, silly me. Didn't mean to cause a stir with you too. We didn't... <laughs> we didn't expect anyone to be here. Oh, um... I was out looking for my cat out here and I remember the TV has been on in the fritz here. What? Just thought I'd stop by and try to get it working again since the last few folks left a bad word for it. You know, they say treat your cats like your f like family. My family doesn't go out on the TV. Okay, seems nice. Speaking of that, now what, what that, now that your folks are here, let me show you around my sweet home. Where right now? I'd be a bad owner if I didn't give, <laughs> yeah, a grand tour. <laughs> oh. 
here's your shower that thing will make you feel like you're bathing under a waterfall in Amazon jungle what? oh this thing doesn't work unfortunately N not to worry I'll get that fixed for you real soon let me show you the other bedroom now okay Look, Harp, this room has a nice bum view. <laughs> bum view. This, ha this ha room has a nice view. You think that's nice, mister? Wait till I show you the deck. Hee <laughs> hee. Follow me now, please. Okay. How slow are you, mate? And how short are you, mate? I'm a woman and I'm taller than you. How? Nice, really crappy view with just a random fence sticking out there. <laughs> oh, is this a, oh. Holy smokes, <laughs> this is incredible. Definitely, definitely cold, incredibly cold. Glad you folks like it. This is one of my favorite spots. The view of the creek is beautiful. Wait, is the creek? That's a great spot for fishing too. All right, folks, let's head back in before I get the cold here. Ooh. Get in. Oh. Hey. Here's the storage room. Look. If you need anything, towels, extra blankets, whatnot, it's all in here. Look. Okay. If the power ever goes out, you you can use this flashlight here on my right. Storms like these, you never know. We might not need it. Trust me. It's always best you to know where your light is. Okay. Alright folks, let's head downstairs now. I like this guy. He's a weirdo. Alrighty folks. I see you already stuck up the fridge with some tasty food. Ow. I'm gonna go blow my nose, I will be back soon. You see the knob? Turn the knob up for more cooling and down for more to cool it off. Okay. <coughs> I tend to keep it low in the winter. The bill gets out of control. Speaking of winter, I better show you folks the heat, the water heater. Okay. Go, 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 go. Um, nothing to worry about down here, just all the water heater, just the water heater and some old storage stuff. 
If it ever stops working, just hit the button at the bottom. The pilot light will fire right back up, right up, and you'll see the and you'll be back in business. I'm terrible at reading. What in the actual? What the? Hmm? Again. Hey, sir. What's the deal with the room over there? Nothing you just need to concern yourselves about with. I kinda use the basement as storage. Free enters don't need the space. Um. They really ought to keep upstairs. Oh, rent us. Okay, well, <laughs> I was just curious. Let's move on. Some guests have reported hearing voices at night and said they could hear something shuffling, shuffling around here. Not too scary, folks, but I, if I were you, I wouldn't really step down here. Okay. Hee hee. Hee hee. The looks in your faces. Hee hee hee. <laughs> Come on now, I'm just talking. Okay. You're a freak. Little creepy man thing. Alrighty, folks. Snow starting to pick up. I'm going to hit the road now. Got to find that rodent toting cat. Thanks for showing us around. Bye, ugly little old man. No. By the way, what was the name in the booking? I must get. I must be getting old. It's Sydney. Ha, huh, Sydney. That's right. Pretty name, very pretty girl. Okay, make on. <coughs> I'm not gonna marry you, something. It's just me or is that dude super weird? Anyways, let's get, let's get, let's go see if there's anything good in the TV. Actually, I'm gonna go take a quick shower. Mate, you've just went to the toilet. Cool, I'll find something to watch while you're in there. <laughs> Let me know what it feels like you <laughs> under a waterfall. What a wheel car. Thanks, we'll see you in a bit. Okay, bye. No, no, no one. Caught. What? Oh. Yeah, good one. Probably should have caught that, actually. Open that store. Okay. Mm oh. Hey, Hor, check this out. I found this while this vision was in the shed. Plan to get some Now that you've mentioned. Wait, that would be pretty epic addition to the trip. Let's do it. Heck yeah, follow me. There's another run in the shade, so we can both give it a shot. Okay. Run to the hills. One miserable little house. So I'm gonna pick it up all night. Mm. Do you wanna grab that fi uh, the fishing rod, Hart? You just keep singing. Mm. Bait. Oh snap, I saw a killer recipe for, for bait, Hart. 
Well, you catch three carp, though, you up here, Jones? Yes. Well, first things first, we need a we need the right bait off a carp. Check out this bait information board. Whenever you're ready, grab a carp, bait, and let's head to Taylor Creek. We're gonna get some carp heart. Please don't make it rise my name. Come in. Ah, sweet corn. What? Cheese delight. Ooh. Come on, Harp. It's this way. Hope those I hope those car are biting today. What? What? Let's see whenever there's one carp, there's no always more. I forgot to say I had to do this three times. What would you expect me to do there? <laughs> you know what? I think this. I think the old saying is right. Bad day of vision is still better than a good day at work. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's not the quiet fish we're aiming for today. We need carp. Drought. That's okay. Woohoo! Just one more carp left. You got this. Say we got the three cop. Do you want to go ahead back and pull more? No. Sydney Harper likes fishing. Who knew? All right, let me know when it's gonna head back. 
Seems pretty cool to me. Well, I'm cleaning the fish. Do you mind preparing the marinade? Sure. Just take a bowl and pour in ginger paste, cooking oil, black pepper, salt, and part of the says, pepper, yeah, and yogurt. Where do we go? What do I get? Oh. Oh, no. Seasoning. That is. Olive oil. Where is the olive oil? Blind. Uh, in the, mm. Do you mind throwing the fish and the marinade and the casserole? What? While well, I uh, chop the veggies. Oh, no. Now could you add the veggies? I've read it needs to go in for 30 minutes or 400. Okay. Boom. Those carbs are going to taste amazing. While we wait for it to cook, how about we play some board games? I heard some in the room. I saw some in the room next to the living room. I guess we're good. Scrub whatever catches your eye. Can't wait to see what you pay. I saw some in the living room. <laughs> okay. Okay, see. Blah, 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 blah. You are an absolute loser. A Jenga, I swear it is. Uh, two stay. Nice to us, Harp. It's been ages since I played this. Totally. I spent a little with me too. Alright, let's see how steady those hands are. Okay. Whenever you're ready, Harp. You're a pro, Harp. Boom, another perfect move by yours truly. 
Wait, you haven't even went to yet. Oh, I will. Oh, come on, that's the one. I can see the tower shaking already. Interesting. Oh god. Yes. You're making it look like child's play. This is how it's done, Hart. I can see them, man. Let, look, game, this game look easy. Yeah. I don't care. Next one. Stone heart. Should just be about done. Let's grab some place. I'm starving. Interesting. Jump scope. I think our show is about to come on. You want to watch TV while we eat? Sure. water park. So first, we are going to prepare the asparagus. Mm. Season these with a lot of salt. Salt is good for the bones. Mm. After letting these simmer in the salt bath, we can start making the chocolate. Mm. Take a couple of cocoa beans. Oh, that was really uh, some. Yes, the Dorum dootin 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 bootin 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 Get out all this. I'll be right by him. Here you are. Anyway, right, a little bit. My cooking instructions. This is the breen of the mayonnaise. We, we got to inject it with a little anesthesia to make sure it doesn't revolt against us. It gets very angry once it knows we're trying to cook it. After doing that, we mix all the ingredients together in a tray. Place it inside. That's cooking with the start and the appetizer. Gasoline soaked ramen. No. Now this dish is extremely hard to make. A 
dish only for experienced cooks. It requires a lot of patience and skill. I think there's someone in my bed right now. Can you go upstairs? Don't mind me, I was just cleaning the room. Wait now, wait, wait, wait. Walk slow. Now. Mm. <laughs> Where did you come from? Got you. What the heck, Mac? I totally got you. Whatever. Come on, it was just a joke. You wanna go for the next round? Next round. How about a game of hide and seek? Fine. Alright, you're on. Count, count, tell you. Huh? Aha! Got you! That wasn't even a challenge. I figured you would be good as... You'd be good at this since I never found you in the city. Maybe you'll look at it. Well, my turn to head now. You better close your ears and talk here. Wait. Six <laughs> Upstairs. Who wants him on you? Who my choice? No kidding, Sydney. I really heard some noobs <laughs> sliding up there. You hear me? I know I did not. I saw him alive. I heard some. I see this addict access to door here.
pretty sure I heard something like that. Why is the steps to? Oh, so there, right? no. What? Get up, dummy. Why is the steps to one? Oh, wait, there, is there, no? What is it? <sighs> what? Where is the stab stool? She's soaking with the entire time. She's <laughs> running soaking with the entire time. It's actually kind of hilarious. Now, looks like there's an in here. Where is the steps? Oh. No, it's a dog. Sydney, are you okay? What was up there? It was just a cut. Oh, that's a relief. I thought I was worried there for a minute. Pardon me. I think she was hungry. Oh yeah, maybe we can give her some carb if I, if I, after I come find you again. Okay. Two shit. I decided to hide in the juicy area in my inbox tower and was just like... <laughs> Where are you? Was that some random guy? Oh man. He's back. He's back for his card. Ah! 
<laughs> there you are. Ow. Room do no <laughs> took me a while to figure out you were in my life the house. Anything worth doing is the worth the well. My room closes pretty ass now. I'm good, dude. Look, I'll hear it all hide now. Well, we're headed back in anyways. You better find me, and we'll go to bed. What? I'm coming for you, mate. But Let's see. What's he doing in this house, man? What the heck are you buggy again? I'm fixing the bus. You got the purple dot? <sighs> I've never seen anyone fix a bus with a hammer before. Never heard many faucet surfs. You are you. You ever fixed any faucet surf in one? Don't think so. So I'd imagine you don't know. What tools you need? How long you been here? Just, I just got here a couple of minutes ago. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. so. Mm. If you got, if you heard anything before that, it must have been an old lady. Remember? <laughs> Look, we do a good bit now. You ask me to leave, miss? No, wait. She's the police. She's been blood. What is this for sale? We rented this house when we like to leave those hills. Uh, we don't like it. We don't really want to have to force the law enforcement. Mark, let me leave the vandalism. Ain't no cops in the woodway, son. You, th you think they're going to be... They're going to arrest the homeowner for fixing the faucet? I was just doing my work. If you can't handle that, it's not your problem. N not mine. Your problem, not mine. You know what? If you folks don't like me fixing the faucet, I'll leave you to it. I'll leave and never come back.
Harp, are you still awake? I do sleep when someone's knocking on the door. Do you mind if I come here and I like talk about something? Sure. Starting to get really bad. Can hardly see the truck in the driveway. Oh, no, it's okay. She'll be just fine, Sydney. Don't worry. I'm here to keep you safe. What? Does that feel like? Hey, it's no problem at all, guys. It's just supposed to watch over people they care about, right? What are you talking about? What day? <laughs> this is not exactly how I was supposed to go. We were supposed to go, Sydney. All right. Can you believe that guy? He was just. He just keeps wandering around. Like he, the house that like he owns the place. He does own the place. You know what that means, he says. He shouldn't just bulge in the place where he feels once. We were in this day. Um, day do, oh, what? <laughs> Carlos, I mean, the guy is very homeless, but I'm frustrated. We do. I really need to go to sleep now, Mark. I really need to go to why don't you come sit by me, Sydney? I told you. Wrong in. Harp, you know. I've missed this. It's stolen. It's been too long. You know, you don't have to sleep alone tonight if you don't want to. Mike, where's this go from? Ugh. You act like you don't remember our trip to Oregon. I remember being awkward. It didn't start out awkward though. Ma. Mike, we had a little drink. Things happened. It's your date, hoping soon come to gain. Oh, Mike, I don't know what to say. You just, let, you just let me worry about the details, Sydney. Mike, I don't think it's a good time. Guys, I think I'm about 70 miles away from Woodbury, and my stinking tire just blew out. It's snowing, and I'm on the side of the road on Highway 11 near Killington. Oh, well, There's a you're sign dead. by the side of the road. It's Hard to see. <coughs> I think it says Kent Pond. Sure. The snow is like half of a deep and I can't get the lug nuts off the tire. <laughs> I hate to ask, but can you two come get me? No. What time and who? I guess we can't leave no by stranded behind why would I Let me get your snow meter doses. No, Sydney, you stay here and Get sleep, there's no sense. Most reason, no bum, soft. 
Well, things talking about later. Go, go, go get some, go dressed and say what? If you, wait, 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 no, 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 wait, wait, wait. Blah, blah, whatever. Lock the door immediately. No. Oh! Ah. Yeah! What? Why don't you get some worse while we go out? No, I've given one worse. Besides, no, I'd probably freaking out more than you are now. You better be No, but she is alright. I'll have to talk. You need something like that? Can you blame me? So I'll go. I will hug. I mean, just in case you sleep when I'm by. I can't go right now. So. Hmm. So, James, get some sleep. 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 Bye. Oh, love it. Bye. We are free. Hello? It is that guy, oh no. Look, friend, I know, I know it isn't the best idea. Ideal banging on your front door in the middle of the night, but I'm in a bad spot here. I was kind of unaware of his friends, but they are going behind and I won't be here for another but tomorrow's. Can you send the post for you, eh? Thanks, but I was hoping you would let me inside to my friend's kid. Get here to help get me. You're not coming in, I'm sorry. Only you have what and kidding me? You wouldn't let me finish to death out here. Get a grip, lad. I didn't make do make you feel disturbed, but I should be no I should have known you was bad because of Boom. Boom boom. <laughs> yeah, I see what I back in the pizza joint. What? You think I didn't see you and your little boyfriend fishing in the creek? Are you? I figured maybe you'd let me get me for chance to break you to Unkind. Get out to him, go on the place. Never know. Ain't no cops around here? Speaking of, I don't see your friend Phil, Phil Strook out here yearly. Yeah. I'm dying 911 now. Fine. Suit yourself. Leave, you little freak. Leave. Well, let me tell you something. You'll get what's coming to you for leaving me out here. Call me a boom, my friend. Okay. How lovely. Has he just killed my friend? He's just killed Mike. 
Lovely. going on here? Oh, thank God you're here. Yeah, I came as quickly as I could. <coughs> I want to worry about him anymore. Oh, he batted him on. Yeah! Go Rick. By the way, where's your friend? The guy who was with you earlier. Like, you want to pick up the phone of a friend? Hmm. So you're all alone right now, huh? Yeah, but my friends will be back soon. around make sure everything's really okay you need to leave right now what did you to say this is my house and i will leave when i want to you need to leave right now i don't think so if anyone is leaving this house it will be one of us supposed to do then? Let's be through on this. Let's be on this. What the? Hello? <laughs> right there.
Oh no. This isn't Rick. No! Why is it lagging so much? Man, what are you doing? What? Oh yeah, that's very fast. Let's just make it as forced to get stay into a door that is obviously open. I can't even be bothered to watch this anymore. I'm just gonna watch this gameplay for just ending because I am not doing this anymore. All right. Well, the guy who made this is um, storms like this bring out all somewhere. kinds of folks. Oh, not all of them know when to stay away. I'm definitely not completing that one. That was so irritating. I absolutely annoyed us out. Come back over. What do you mean? I live in Burlington. I haven't been to the rental in weeks. Like, absolutely. I don't even want to say it. But, uh, yeah. I can't go up the stairs. Okay, everything okay? Ooh! In this house. You? Hi, dude! Yeah, the base. Go back up the stairs. What? My thing, I couldn't even escape through the door, man. Absolute rubbish game. Is he faster than me? Very on me. Um, so he's supposed to run up the stairs. Makes sense, I guess. I don't know why I would just run out the back door, like, but still.
You don't spoil, by the way. Sleepy out, we're almost there. I think I might have to go back down. Oh, maybe not. Come back over. What do you, uh, are you alright? Just gonna talk to other guests on phone. I called 911. Kitty. I think I have to go back down. This guy is dead. Oh my god, mate, you're useless. Why can't I move? Sorry. Oh my god! Jesus Christ! So that was the end in the game. Try the back like, door, right brother. A window, maybe? I told him everything that happened after Mike had left. Rick had called the cops. The storm had quieted down by the time they arrived, and of course the man was nowhere to be seen. Oh. What about the hitchhiker? On our drive back, the whole night played over and over in my head. We think that the man we saw secretly lived in that cabin when it wasn't being used, and planned on robbing us during our stay. I mean, that would but make cops sense seemed to think there was more intent like, behind this man's we, actions we, aside we, from we, just robbing us. And yeah, what was in that room like, in the basement? You know. Oh, Rick asked me what the man looked shared. like after that, or and after that, he didn't ask any more questions. We think he knew more than he was letting on, but in the end, he gave us a full refund. Wow, the story is a happy ending. $99 back, baby. Nice. There's another ending? What's the other ending? Or how do you do it? Just drive back when you're going to the cabin? Oh, both ends. You turn time, baby! Harp, do you get a license from a cereal box? Shut up, bitch. Man. <laughs> 10 out of 10 ending that like. Anyways, goodbye.